Introducing version 2.1 of Reddit HQ open source test automation framework. One of the biggest new features that was added is being able to easily import your existing testNG and JUnit tests. This way, you'll be able to use Redwood HQ to execute across multiple machines and analyze their historical results for any type of test case you already have, like REST SOAP API, Selenium, Epium, and any others. Let me show you how easy and fast it is to do it. First, you upload your testNG or JUnit project into Redwood HQ. As you can see, all of the files have been uploaded and ready to be used. The next step is to import those test cases. By clicking on the Import Test Cases button, selecting the test cases you want to import, and now your test cases are ready to be used and executed through Reddit HQ. And just like for any other test automated run, you can select multiple threads and machines where execution will take place, run selected test cases, observe test execution happening in real time through VNC viewer, analyze test case details results for a failure, see the error, the stack trace, the screenshot, and you can even click on the stack trace to bring right to the code where the failure has happened. And at the end, you can compare historical test results across multiple executions. All of this and other features makes Redwood HQ more powerful than any other frameworks like Selenium Grid, Robot Framework, or plain old CLI runs, and is fully compatible with continuous integration tools. We have also added other features like being able to execute right from the scripts page, a very extensive update to documentation, as well as multiple bug fixes and enhancements. As always, you can download the latest version of Redwood HQ from www.redwoodhq.com and please leave us your feedback here on YouTube or our Google Groups forum. Thank you.